Okay, so once upon a time, there was the best April Fool's joke ever. Um, now for the story, little boys and girls, we're going to change the names to help protect the real people's identities. Okay, so the main character is Lisa. The second character is Adriana, and the third is Kathy. Alright, so Lisa is a really good friend of mine. And Lisa had texted me on my phone, texty texty, um, I guess this afternoon, and I was in class, so I didn't get it. And then I got home, and I got on my computer, and I had like four IMs that said, uh, <laughs> um, I got four IMs from her, and she's like, dude, where are you? I need to talk to you right now. You know, blah, blah, blah. It's like, it's really important. I'm like, okay, calm down. And then I check my phone, and I see that she had texted me again. So I text her back. I'm like, what's up? What's going on? And she, she, I ends me back. And I'm like, oh, pick a freaking electronic and stick with it. So she ends me. She's like, this is so fucked up. And I was like, what? She's like, Adriana just texted me this morning and was like, um, hey, that party that you had a couple weeks ago, me and Kathy hooked up. And Kathy's a lesbian that... And, and and Lisa is a is a bisexual and um, Lisa had really liked Kathy and um, so it was kind of a big deal because Adriana was her best friend she's like how could you hook up with someone that I used to really 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 like and um, she's like I'm sorry I'm sorry I'm sorry and anyways but Lisa was just she's telling me she's like I cannot believe she did that I was like well you know I'm trying to console her and I'm like well you know at least, and of course, the, being the person that I am, I always try to take both sides. Like, I try to, you know, maintain a neutrality. So I'm like, well, I mean, at least she told you and not someone else. You know, and at least she told you. And she's like, I don't care. It's still messed up. Like, it's, 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 you don't do that. Like, you, you just don't do that. And I was like, well, was she drunk at all? Because I know it's not an excuse, but it does help. It's like, yeah, she said she was wasted. I was like, all right, well... I mean, you and you and Kathy never actually were going out, and it's not like they were sober. And I just, I felt so bad for her because she was seriously taking it really badly. And I was like, you know, I'm trying to be a good friend and agree with her, even though I did think that she was kind of being a little excessive with the anger. And I was like, all right, all right. So I tried to, you know, text Adriana and Kathy both. And I'm like, guys, seriously, what were you thinking? Anyways, that went on for like another hour and a half, just me freaking out for them because, freaking out for, for Lisa because I just felt so bad and I didn't know what to do. Like, I seriously felt like the mother. And, um, then I, then I was trying to make Lisa feel better by like, maintain, like just saying silly jokes and, cause she had said, uh, Adriana was a slut and a whore and I was like, well, I thought whores got paid. <laughs> and I was like, you know what would be really messed up too is if, uh, this was like an April Fool's joke on you. Like, if Adriana and Kathy hadn't really hooked up, and they were just doing it, like, as an April Fool's joke. And, um, she's, she's like, no, it's, it's, I don't know, like, it's just, she's too believable when she called me, like, like, it was just, I don't know. I just feel really, really bad. Five minutes later, I get a text message from all three of them, from, I got a text message from Kathy, Adriana, and Lisa, all saying, um, April Fool's. April Fool's bitch, and April Fool's ha 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 ha. And they sent it to me, and I was like, what? So I was right, it was an April Fool's joke? Like, I didn't, I, I didn't get it. And so I messaged them all back, and I was like, wait, was this shit on me? Bitches. I hate you all. LOL. Not really. Anyways, if you get the gist of this hot mess... Uh, what I thought was an April Fool's joke on Lisa was an April Fool's joke on me because they took advantage of the fact of how motherly I am and how I they knew I was going to get stressed out and try to help everybody and yeah. And it was an April Fool's joke on me. And it might not be the best April Fool's joke ever, but it's the best one that's ever been pulled on me. Anyways, yeah. My April Fool's joke on other people today was on my roommate, um, 
My roommate is big on breakfast, and I took all of the breakfast food out of the cabinets, so when she opened them, there'd be nothing there. And I was like, haha, April Fool's, no food for you. <laughs> and then I sent out a, like two or three Twitters today about, um, like I made, I took the links to Rick Rolls and I turned them into other links. So like I made one that was um, uh, utfootball.tk and then I sent a Twitter. I was like, oh my gosh, look, they, look what UT put on their football site. Ha ha ha. Like it was funny. And then people would click it and it Rick Rolled them. Um, another one was uh, I Sidekick, like iPhone, and I was like, look what Apple's coming out with, I can't believe this, and then people will click it, because of course they want to see if there's an I Sidekick. And then I made another one, uh, Obama Clinton Unite TK and um, Apple Microsoft Alliance TK, because those are things people are going to actually click, and every time they click them, they get rickrolled. Ha 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 ha. Anyways, so um, that was my story. I guess this could be my me today, since I'm probably not going to do another one tonight. But anyways, if you understood anything I just said, then congratulations. If not, I'm sorry. I talk extremely fast, and I'm all, like, hyper-excited because it was it was a good, good April Fool's. Alright. Um, yeah. Comments? The end. <laughs>